Hello and welcome to the Simu UK. As promised, I said I would get that working and I have done. It's a weird situation whereby I don't really know what's causing it, but I have a bit of software that moves whatever game I'm playing to whatever screen I want it on after it starts, and that seems to have really buggered it up. Don't know why exactly, maybe I can figure that out at another time, but for now, at least I got that video nice and smooth for you to enjoy. So I'm thinking about jumping into a campaign. Um, easy, normal or hard. I kind of want to go on hard, but I'm going to go normal. I'm going to skip the tutorial because we've already done that. And um, we'll just see what happens here. Hopefully something good. Create your Admiral. Okay, Sim UK. I'm loving that Tash. Got a Magnum PI looking Tash going on. Why doesn't his face match this, I wonder? Maybe it will happen afterwards. Oh yes, the Captain Bird's Eye beard. <laughs> I've had one too many cap position. So many things I could say about that one. Oh, that's a pretty full on. We're going to go for that. Skills, air and navy. I don't know. Can I change any of this? Apparently not. Starting order, DC reinforcements, voice. Hard work is what keeps the ship moving. Hard work is what keeps the ship moving. I'm going to go for voice two. So there's only four faces. There's all these portraits, but only four faces. Okay, I'm going to go with face two. Hair and hat. Okay, I'm, I'm trying to recreate this guy over here. It's it's proving not to be very, very easy. Okay, accessories other. I'd like some binoculars. Cigarette in the mouth. Pipe. Here we go with the binoculars. Service white, definitely. How do I get his hat then? There we go. <laughs> oh, wow. Goodness me. There we go. Proper stuff. Okay, continue. No beards though, I'm a bit disappointed unless I miss them. I would have liked to have put a beard on this guy. Try and match my portrait as much as possible. Now the loading times in the tutorial were pretty extensive. So um, expect some uh, long delays is all I can tell you. Oh, not too bad. Right. Do you know what? Maybe I should have gone on the tutorial because I don't know what half of this does. Escort section. Manage your carrier's escort ships. So it looks like I can unlock some uh, ships at a later date. So I've got a a Type 2 S cargo sinking. Sink a random cargo ship from a selected enemy fleet within 500 miles after the order's duration period. Saipan Type 2 free cap. Use a cap mission to increase the defense value of 
both your carrier and escort without using squadrons from your hangar. And a chickpea. What the hell? Where's the chickpea? Replenish two squadrons of a chosen type can be used one time between each visit to Pearl Harbor. Okay. So I've got torpedo bombers, fighter aircraft and dive bombers. Eight of each. So I've got a radar, USS Saratoga. Which I can change the name of. Really? Very short name. USS Ultimate. That's quite a good name, actually. So I've got one anti-aircraft station. Hangar capacity is 24. I can increase that. Um, the aircraft I've looked at. The crew. Oh, look at this. Novice crew. Novice. Novice, 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 novice. Okay, so they're all novice. Valentine Edward K, a former Naval Academy instructor, known for his quick witted judgments in difficult situations. Precision bombing. Def plus four if the previous maneuver used fighters. Adams J. Warren, a very promising officer, he has risen through the ranks rapidly and was recently awarded the China Service Medal. Okay. So at the moment I only have two officer slots and eight crew unit slots. Now this says zero. Is that their rank? I assume that's their rank as opposed to... Recruited staff, so I can buy more staff. Perhaps I should have gone for that tutorial option. I thought it would be the same as the first tutorial. Apparently not. Okay. Well, let's launch and just see what happens. Wake Island is under attack following the strike on Pearl Harbor. The Imperial Japanese Navy continues its offensive on US and British overseas territories, launching a surprise attack on the garrison at Wake. On Wake, Our embattled forces in the area may be insufficient to defend the island's base, and low visibility prevents the effective counter-attack. They face defeat without your support. Also, a visiting US cabinet official is trapped on the island. It is up to you to rescue him. First, you must defeat the enemy carrier coordinating attacks on the island before launching a rescue mission to save the civilian VIP. So we have to locate and destroy the enemy carrier to stop its attack on Wake Island and then launch and recover a mission to rescue the civilian VIP trapped in the island's garrison. Finish the mission within 20 hours. Maximum squadrons lost two, minimum enemies destroyed three. The situation shifts constantly. Finishing some missions temporarily changes the state of affairs during the following mission. Change of circumstances. Show how the circumstances will change after the selected mission. Current circumstances active during your next mission. Use this to plan the order of upcoming missions. Current circumstances in the theatre of war will not alter your next mission in any way. No new circumstances will be activated during your next mission. Okay. Let's begin. A little bit apprehensive about this. I'm sure that's fairly similar to what the real uh, Navy officers at the time would have been feeling. Or perhaps they've been uh, expecting it. Well, not, not exactly Pearl Harbor, but perhaps they've been expecting to be in the war pretty soon and sort of prepared. It's possible they were itching to get going.
Wake Island has just been attacked by the Japanese Navy, Admiral. There is a White House official on the island, visiting our base there. We cannot get to him while the island is under fire, so we need to find the exact location of the enemy carrier attacking the base. And destroy it! Once that has been dealt with, we will have a short space of time within which to carry out the rescue. You must launch a rescue mission to the base, where our men will take the VIP on board for a safe return to our carrier. Okay, so they sort of showed the enemy to be up here. Now, is that where they are, or is that just a, a red herring? I don't know. Alright, let's get myself settled. Hunt down the enemy carrier located around Grid Square J3 and destroy it. Okay. So, if I do... Recon? No, let's go identify targets. We're going to need one dive bomber. Oh, okay, you could switch. So you have control over what, what it does. Enemy scouts detected. Okay. Alright, so I need to get some uh, fighter planes up here. Squadron on the deck. Two of. You can see them circling me already. Launch those guys, and then we'll get some dive bombers up here. How many do I need for uh, just one? So they're going to come in, they're going to fly up here, and they're going to head back. Speaking of which, uh, we're going to move. Launch aircraft. As well try and get away from these scout airplanes I should have waited actually till they were gone so they're off to intercept these scouts Not sure if I can see that battle. Your fleet has been detected by the enemy. Funny that. Okay, so I need those dive bombers to come and issue a dive bomber squadron on the deck. Identify the enemy. We'll send a strike group out there and try and take them down. I've got a few others here. Cap, cap. Cap flight. I'm not sure. What, I'm not sure what cap stands for. I think the game has told me before, but I don't remember. Okay, so that mission has not been activated in the island, so I need to come in here Full focus now. and add one airstrike mission. So I've got two missions out there now. So we want to prepare something, but we, I can't prepare until we know what we've got. That's not going to happen. If 
but my guess is we're going to have some torpedo bombers. That's some dive bombers. And I don't know what else, so we'll wait and see. If I start getting them out ready, then we can launch quicker. Move at half speed. A torpedo bomber squadron on the deck. My plane's taken out this scout, or what? Ten minutes remaining. Nine minutes remaining. Issue a dive bomber squadron on the deck. Tactical map update. Unknown object. Enemy scouts have been destroyed. Okay, good. Unknown object. I wonder if it's possible to catch both of them at the same time. That would be very helpful. Okay, so I've got one hour to get these planes landed, which is not long. And we've identified the targets. New enemy was found. Escort carrier, destroyer, light cruisers. Okay, so if I go for an airstrike now... Ah, then we've got to build the strategy over here. So we've got anvil attack, which requires two... Um, torpedo aircraft attack and defense of maneuver number five plus 125 oh okay oh that's interesting so whatever I put in number five it will give me 125 of whatever that is so if I put that there oh it does it doubles that up pretty much anyway Okay, that was quite a good start. Defense of the previous maneuver plus 125. Attack and defense of adjacent maneuvers plus 50%. Attack of maneuvers number one and number five plus 75. That's quite a good one. Stick that in the middle. Did that change? Seven and four. So I need to put something attacking in number five. Attack of this maneuver plus five if maneuver number three is supportive. Is that supportive? That's defensive. So that's supportive. Okay. So I'll pop that in there then. boosts our defense. You can see we've got 31 and 20 up here and they're 51 to 59. Got a strong attack. Um, so that goes in there quite nicely. What was that one? Um, 
That boosts that up quite nicely. Okay. Um, right. Mm, okay. So analysis of the current strategy suggests that zero to one enemy targets will be destroyed. So that's not very good. Um, analysis of the current strategy suggests that two to four of your dispatch squadrons will return from the attack heavily damaged if they return at all. Boosting your defences might be beneficial. Okay, let's try again. Clearly that's not good. So 11 attack, 8 defence, 10 attack. So defense of all offensive maneuvers up by 50%. Okay. So let's drop that in there. So that's got to go to four or five. I don't know what happened. That's gone up to five. It was three, it's gone up to five, okay. So I need to be a bit more defensive, huh? So there was something. So that really boosts our defence. Then if this one is supportive... That's quite strong. No, too much. Three to four of your squadrons will be heavily damaged. Ah. It's going to be tricky, isn't it? So we may have to launch multiple attacks, basically. a big boost isn't it so our defenses are really quite high so really I want my defense to be twice as high as my attack Actually, it makes sense that that one go in the middle.
Oh, look at this. This strategy almost guarantees the safety of your pilots, but there is a risk of losing one squad squadron. Okay, that's pretty good. Um, analysis suggests that this attack will definitely damage one enemy target, but will not destroy it. Boosting the offensive further might be beneficial, but if I change my target, then they reckon one to two enemy targets will be destroyed. So let's try and take out the destroyer. We're probably going to have to send two attacks for the escort carrier. I think that's pretty good. I'm quite happy with that. Let's go. And then return for the pickup. All right, sweet. That's our first one. Um, so what do we need? We need three of each. Uh, so another dive bomber. Dive bomber squadron on the deck. Not enough crew, it says. Air department. Let's just grab you. So I've got one hour to deal with this. Oh no, I've got one hour to get him out of the ground. Come on, dude. Where is he? Hurry up, man. Hurry up. He's there. He's there. Uh, so what have I got? What have I got? So I need a torpedo bomber. Okay. Issue a torpedo bomber squadron on the deck. That's the airstrike gone. I don't know. If, well, it won't be enough to take them out. So we're going to have to send another airstrike. But we'll see what we can do. And then I guess we ought to get this plane landed. Oh, it's going to be tight, look. Stand by to start engine. 39 minutes. Oh man, am I going to lose an aeroplane straight away? Too slow, too slow. Come on, drag them all up there. Why are you doing one at a time? It just takes so long. They should be in a long line. They should all be lined up, all of them. Not wait for them three to go and then the next three. That just adds so much time to uh, to proceedings. Twenty minutes. Nineteen. Oh no. They take it so long. There's no way we're going to get there in time. You see, if they were just moving up there now, even if they sat here, that would all of them would be gone in in less than 10 minutes. Ah, oh, fantastic. We're going to lose a squadron straight away. I hope they change this. Because that is infuriating. But there's men there. I was thinking maybe it's because there aren't enough men, but there's men by every aeroplane, so just move now. Yeah, I think we've lost them. Unbelievable. Doesn't tell me that I've lost those planes though, does it? Two on a mission. Oh yeah, I've lost. I've I've lost two planes. Look. 
We've gone from eight to six. We've lost a bomber as well somehow. That just takes too long. Tactical map information update. Sir, a member of your staff requires urgent medical aid. Have a DC team transport him to the infirmary. Sir, a member of your staff requires Awaiting urgent orders. medical aid. Have a DC team transport him to the infirmary. What's happened? Ready! How did he get injured? On your command! Who's injured then? I don't know who's injured. Stand by to recover aircraft. Okay, so I've lost one unit of airplanes, stupidly, because uh, it took too long to get planes off the deck. Um, that's definitely something I'm going to have to mention in my review. There's too much linear nature I mean sometimes it's really good but yeah there's definitely some work could be done there I'm gonna send some scouts up as well I think lost a dive bomber I get it now your losses are in red so we took out the destroyer and the light cruisers but we didn't get rid of the escort carrier let's have a watch missed Oh, one of my planes got shot down. Crew unit is injured. Really? Where? Awaiting orders. Who's injured? I think he's dealt with the uh, injured guy. Clear the flight deck and prepare for takeoff. Let's get ready for launching and let's do some scouting so we get some. Uh, fighters up on deck. so much I don't yet understand in this game. So much more I need to work out.
What's a CAP stand for? I can't remember. Hmm. Are they bombers, are they? Issue a fighter squadron on the deck. Right, scouts are up. So I guess I need to send another load of planes towards the enemy. Start engine. Ah, insufficient crew in navigation, so I can only go half speed. Right, let's get the scout crew up, please. Come on. Chop, 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 chop. And the airstrike will be back in 48 minutes, okay. So it should be two squadrons of fighters going. So last time it was two lots of dive bombers, no three lots of dive bombers, three lots of torpedoes. So I'll set the same, I'll set two of each up and then we'll try and uh, prep the deck. Actually we've got to go to recovery here haven't we? 32 minutes. Should just speed things up a bit. Tactical map update. Okay. Issue a torpedo bomber squadron on the deck. Issue a torpedo bomber squadron on the deck. You know why I'm complaining about the planes taking so long to line up? You, you must have seen video footage or photographs of um, World War Two. Clear the flight deck. A plane is approaching landing. Enemy scouts detected. Oh no. You've seen how they all lined up, like, you know, all along the flight deck, ready for takeoff. Right, oh yeah. Stand by to recover our craft. I've got to recover all of them. I love the animations of the characters, they're so cool. Right, you can go back downstairs. The scouts are going to f figure out where we are in a second. Just, everything's taking so long. We've got 50 minutes to counter the scouts. And I need two fighter planes on deck and I have none. But if I go and attack them and sink their ship, then it doesn't matter about the scouts because they're going to have nowhere to land.
tactical map update. Okay. Wish I knew how many. Move the torpedo bomber squadron back to the hangar. Oh, there we go. I'm not going to be able to counter those scouts, so they're going to identify my location. Then they're probably going to attack us. Which means I should change direction, really. We spot the deck. Prepare for launching. All right. Airstrike. Prepare. To the target. Target is locked. We want to be very defensive. Um... So that will give us way more defense. So if I go for that. Attack and defensive maneuver 20, uh, number 5. So we can do a torpedo run on that. And then just go fully defensive. That too many planes. This strategy requires more squadrons than you can currently deploy on the flight deck. Okay, so I have to go for something. Fifty-eight, fifty-two. That seems pretty good. This strategy ensures the safety of your pilots. All of the dispatch squadrons will return from the attack. Analysis of the current strategy suggests that zero to one enemy targets will be destroyed, boosting the offensive. Well, that's a risk I'm going to have to take. So, we need one fighter plane. Issue a fighter squadron on the deck. And that's it, we're good. And one torpedo, yeah? One fighter and one torpedo. Ah! That means I have to put these guys back. Move the dive bomber squadron back to the hangar. Because I've run out of splot slots. See, this bit's cool. I like how they do this. That's quite smart. You see, look, he could have been going down the lift whilst these two are repositioning. I just feel like the animations really hold everything up. I love the animations. It's just that there's no logic to sitting there and waiting for the other two planes when you're trying to quickly clear the deck. What do I need? I've forgotten already. Torpedo. Issue a torpedo bomber squad. Oh, we're under attack. I knew we would be because the scouts found us, you see. Right, let's launch the airstrike. Hopefully I can fight off these guys. Launch it. Two fighters, two fighters. Scouts have finished patrolling in the area. Enemy is still there. Uh, I was going to say, there should be a guy already dealing with that. Here come the enemy. Absolutely tons of them as well. Alright, come on, how are we doing? It just takes so long. Move up. Move up now. 
Don't wait until they're gone before you move. That takes too long. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Fight off these uh, attackers. Issue a fighter squadron on the deck. Go, go, go. And then prep for landing. What can I do over here? DC reinforcements. Better get in. On the double. So now I've got three guys. Okay, that's good. I like that. None of your planes were damaged. Your airmen managed to damage one enemy target, but the damage was not critical. Damn. Looks like one of my planes is damaged, though. Missed with the torpedo. Missed again. Good. Stand by to recover aircraft. Okay, let's recover these guys to the deck. Maybe then we can immediately uh, relaunch them. Your location is unknown to the enemy. Oh, that's good. But uh, they're getting very close, these guys. Tactical map information update. Yeah, they don't know where we are yet. Okay, they'll be back in an hour. So let's get to launch. Let's do scouting. You were detected by the enemy. So they did detect us anyway. That's a shame. Start engine. Carrier is under attack. Yeah. Sir, damage control is needed. Your airmen clashed with the enemy. Some of their planes require urgent repairs. To pump it out. And we've taken some hits, there it sounds like. Fire below deck. Sir, damage control is needed. Oh man, it's bad. Very bad. On your command, ready. Two guys on fire patrol. Hello, Shadow. We've got to try and get that fire out. We see the guys coming in there. Trying to deal with that fire before it spreads. What's this? Counter submarine. Holy cow. We've got a submarine attack coming in now. 
Issue a torpedo bomber squadron. Is it a torpedo? Hang on, wait, 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 wait. wait. No, bomber. Freak. Brought out the wrong ones. Issue a dive bomber squadron on the deck. Okay, so I need. Uh, where the hell's the submarine? We are getting absolutely smashed here by the enemy. This is on normal difficulty. Bloody Issue hell. Dive bomber squadron on the deck. Okay, they're, they're going to launch. And then we'll clear the deck. Dive bomber squadron back to the hangar. I said these guys. Did I click on the wrong damn thing? Oh my god, look at all this. It's all going off. So they're now coming back because they know where we are. We have a submarine. We had a fire. The fire seems to be out. We spot the deck. Prepare for recovery. Awaiting orders. On your command. Now we've got a submarine attacking us. Why haven't these guys taken off? Move the torpedo bomber squadron back to the hangar. Oh my good god. Oh my good god. Issue a dive bomber squadron on the deck. Prepare for launching. Try again. Get rid of that submarine. Submarines can sink ships big time. I'm also very worried about these guys. Hopefully we'll get rid of that submarine before we can do any damage. Shut down. Wow. If you want to continue repairing malfunctions, you must restore it. Okay, so we took an absolute pound in there. Um, let's have everyone go straight to the hangar. Stand by to recover aircraft. Admiral, we're taking water. You should send DC teams to pump it out. Where are we taking water? To work. We're on fire at the moment. Maybe that will put the fire out. Sir, the engine section is shut down. Without it, we will only be able to travel at dead slow pace. Okay, good news. The enemy submarine has been destroyed. Have we got those fires under control yet? Not yet. Where's the flooding? I don't see the flooding. OK, 
Okay, one fire is out. Ready. Fires are out. Awaiting orders. Ready. So let's get two people working on the uh, machine. One person working on the on the water. Terrible weather. Getting busy up top as well. Okay, scouts are finished. The enemy's definitely heading this way. So much damage. So much damage. This is so much harder than I realized it was going to be. Admiral, we're taking water. You should send DC teams to pump it out. The deck operation queue is full, okay. Plane wrecks on the flight deck. Where? Where? Oh, there. Great. How do I? How do I? Uh... We're taking water. You should send DC teams to pump it out. On your command. Oh yeah, I see. Oh wow, we're proper flooded. It's okay. I think we. I think we're dealing with that. How do I deal with this though? Awaiting orders. How do I Oh, it's gone. Okay. Stand by to recover aircraft. No more plane crashes tonight, please. You should send DC teams to pump it out. Yeah, we're getting there. We're getting there. We're getting there. Fear not. The flooding is under control. Awaiting orders. We've lost quite a lot of planes. Yeah, we lost quite a lot. Cannot be launched at night. The required planes are not on the flight deck. Two fighter planes? What have I got here then? God damn it. Let's get set up. Whilst we're here, let's resupply the ship I can't do it yet two hours and 15 minutes okay we're we still taking on water we'll be good now I think we're up and running again which is good move the dive bomber squadron back to the hangar Bring this guy back down here to navigation. That way we can move a little bit faster. On the deck. Oh, okay, that's handy. I've only got 8% fuel. I'm going to have to refuel. 
one hour and 31 minutes, okay. So let's get the deck set up, ready for launching. My location is unknown to the enemy. That's how I like it. Okay. So when can I... Uh, I guess when that turns back to a sun. About six in the morning or something, I imagine. So I've got two planes there already. Uh, recon. So I'm going to get two dive bombers. Two dive bombers ready for recon. Let's speed up. So as soon as it goes daylight, we'll be on it. On your command. Issue a dive bomber squadron on the deck. Ready. You were detected by the enemy. How? Oh, because we're at half speed, probably making noise. That probably means a uh, submarine, right? I bet you there's a submarine on its way. Right, 31 minutes and I can get a resupply. Yeah, look, they're heading our way now. When we resupply, we'll go quiet, so they won't be able to deal with us then. Three AM. On the double. Better get to it. Time to work. Okay, so we're going to go full stop and uh, the resupply ship is going to come in and resupply us with fuel. Look at that, that's so cool. Okay, that's going to take a little while. And uh, what do we think? What do we think they have? Just one escort carrier. Come on. We've got to be able to take him out first thing. Get some scouts up. Neutral ship, neutral ship. It's good to see. Don't need to worry about them. Ten past four. Carrier is under attack. Awaiting orders. Roger that. I think I need a cap mission. Cannot be launched at night. How have they attacked me then if we can't launch at night? How come they can launch so much quicker than us? Awaiting orders. Can we fly again? We'll focus now. Nope, still can't launch at night. Come on. They're going to kill us here. Launch. Stand by to start engine.
Okay, we're going to need an air department again. Oh, healthy crew unit. Let's bring him up here. We get maximum amount of planes up in the air then. Right. Mission has not been activated in the island. Okay. Airstrike. Prepare. Oh, they're nice and close to us, look. Right, let's go for a heavy attack. Double heavy attack. The strategy ensures the total destruction of the opposing forces and ensures the safety of my pilots. That's perfect. Oh no. Requires more squadrons than you can currently deploy on the flight deck. Anvil, Bulwark, Lone Wolf, Jink and Torpedo Run. Where are my men? They're there. Why can't I deploy this? I don't understand. Airstrike, prepare. Attack the target. Okay, it's kept it. Why can't I do that? What's the problem? Okay, let's drop the bulwark for defensive bombing. Still good? Sweet. Let's confirm. Go back to the deck. What do we need? Uh, I need a fighter. Oh my god, I need a fighter plane and three torpedo. Okay, total destruction of the enemy. That's exactly what we're after. Torpedo bomber squadron on the deck. And we're about to get attacked. Issue a torpedo bomber squadron on the deck. Immediate launch. This uh, airstrike should be enough to take down the enemy. Combat Air Patrol. Your airmen clash with the enemy. Some of their planes require urgent repairs. Okay. No serious damage. The crew unit is injured. Awaiting orders. Go give med medical help then. I see he's up there, look. Goes. Give him medical attention right now. No fires, no flooding. I think we're okay. Scouts are still up there. I want to send up a counter scout unit if I can. No, I haven't got time. 14 minutes. The enemy are going to know where we are, but hopefully the airstrike will get to them before they can even take off. Tactical map update. I'm trying to run away.
Issue a fighter squadron on the deck. Get some fighters up here. We'll just do a basic recon, I think. None of your planes were damaged. Your airmen destroyed all of the enemy targets. New mission objective information. Okay. Locate and sink the enemy carrier is a success. Launch and recover the VIP rescue mission. Send the special mission to Wake Island to rescue the trapped VIP and recover the aircraft upon their return. Okay. VIP rescue mission. I need one of each plane. Okay, I can do that. Launch aircraft. So we're going to get the scouts up just to give us some uh, aerial protection. All right early warning system and then uh, I'll bring up one of each although it says we don't have any fighter planes damn it it's prep for landing Prep for landing, and then I'll bring up the uh, additional planes. Issue a dive bomber squadron on the deck. So I want a fighter plane. Oh, they have to go to the hangar because they're damaged. That's annoying. Issue a torpedo bomber squadron on the deck. That will leave us with the uh, the one aircraft we need. So then we can reconfigure. Yep, that's good. Then we can reconfigure to launch. Map update. What's that two? That's oh, because it's mission two. Okay. Stand by to recover aircraft. The strike group is too far from this mission's recovery area. Oh. How are we? We're right by them. We'll head, uh, we'll head back down then. Let's, uh, let's go to full speed. Half speed. Don't tell me I lost those planes. Did I lose more planes? That's crazy. We were right where we needed to be. Oh, here they are. This is them. So these guys should come onto deck. 
And they should be fighter planes. Fighters, torpedo, bombers. There we go. We are in good shape. Looking good. Looking good. How many have landed? We spot the deck, prepare for launching. Here we go. Recent order has ended, that's fine. Come on boys, get yourselves up there. Start engines. Did I not click launch? <laughs> They're not gonna get very far if I don't click that button. So I think we got one scout group up there, which means we sh we shouldn't get any surprises. Ready. See what I mean? This group here could easily move up, and that would save. 10 15 seconds per mission, which equates to about 10 15 minutes. That's huge, huge amounts of time. Issue a fighter squadron on the deck. Well, we've only got one fighter squadron operational. I wonder if I can repair quicker. Reduce squadron repair times. Let's do that. Okay, scouts finished patrolling. We spot the deck. Prepare for recovery. Stand and recover. So it should be two squadrons. First squadron should go down below. Second squadron should come up here and park with these guys so that I can send up a cap, basically. Or have a cap available to me should I want to send them up. The VIP rescue mission will be back in 25 minutes, so I think we're pretty good here. This is definitely looking promising. An airplane crashed on deck. Oh well. On your demand. Fabulous. There is a fire below deck. Sir, damage control is needed. Oh wow, they just push it off the edge of the boat. <laughs> well that's one plane less to deal with. That's a bit frustrating. That means I don't have that second group. So if one plane crashes, do I lose all the planes? Do I lose the entire group? That seems a bit harsh. If fire below deck. Sir, damage control is needed. Dealt with, dealt with, dealt with. All under control. Stop. 
Stand by to recover aircraft. Okay, this should be it. As long as they don't crash when they bring the VIP back. Enemy scouts. Okay, let's get ready to launch. As long as they don't crash, I should have two fighter planes on deck immediately. go. Three fighter planes are on deck. They're immediately going to go up and uh, attack the enemy. Hopefully before they discover where we are. Aha! Wow. Wow. <laughs> I'm certainly not an expert, am I? Uh, maximum squadrons lost two, I lost five. It took me one day and nine hours. Should have taken 20 hours. So that first strike should have taken them all out. Well done, Admiral. Your service is a credit to the Allies. Every mission you carry through to completion, whatever its objectives, is another step towards victory. The Wake Island Rescue. My renown increases, I'm now level 2, commander points go up by 5, upgrade points go up by 6. I can award medals. Uh, I'm going to give this guy a medal. What are these? Doesn't tell me. Ooh. Choose a reward. Grants additional 10% efficiency when assigned to a department in which all the slots are filled. Grants additional 7% efficiency when assigned to any department. Gotta be. Oh, hello. Grants additional 10% efficiency when assigned to the air department. Grants additional 10% efficiency when assigned to the damage control department. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do that because damage control is so important. Wow, that was tough. Um, clearly, I think I need to be more aggressive with my airstrikes. That seems to be where I went wrong. And I'm a bit slow in responding to some things, I think. But that will come with time. At least we uh, completed the mission. Why don't I have any planes or boats or anything? Ah, available vessels. Okay. So I have two Type 2 S uh, submarines. I have the Saipan Type 2. And the Saipan Type 2 is getting repairs. So, do I just drag them? That's pretty cool, isn't it? So I guess we'll just roll out with the same setup. Command points used to recruit personnel and obtain vehicles. Upgrade points used to unlock upgrades for your task force. Can I get some more? Anti-aircraft station, radar range, hangar capacity. So let's increase radar range. So 
So I think that's happened. And we'll increase the anti-aircraft. And we'll increase radar range again. So that gives us the best radar range you could possibly have. Crew unit slots. Let's upgrade that. So I can have a new unit. Let's go for this guy, he looks smiling. Awesome, okay. Um, So I can unlock So what what fighter pilots do I have at the moment? Oh I definitely need some more, look at this. We're we're definitely down. Unlock What does that unlock? I don't understand. Because they're the same plane, so what does it unlock? Oh, I think I just... Ah. Oh. Okay, I don't really understand what I'm unlocking, if I'm being honest. Okay, I can buy additional, I can buy a single escort carrier, I'm definitely going to do that, and then maybe we'll swap the S-Type for that. Oh, okay, that's more planes, but it gives us more defence, so... Yeah, maybe that makes sense. I don't know. All right, I'm going to leave it there. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that was um, enjoyable, if that's the right word. But uh, informative is probably the best I can really hope for. So, yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Until then, take care. Goodbye for now.